I do funny videos with my cats, like you do. And I'm also an actor, but since meeting this amazing dude and he taught me about rescue, I now work with a bunch of nonprofits. I help with Trap Neuter Return, and I actually just partnered with Beagle Freedom Project and turned an animal testing lab into a sanctuary for 180 beagles and 80 cats in Oklahoma. So yeah. Go for it. And with Trap King Humane Cat Solutions, that's my nonprofit that I started in 2017. I uh, traveled the world assisted in TNR and community cat care. Hooked up with my buddy Nathan the Cat Lady, who's been helping me with my social media. I've yeah. drug him into the rescue world. Yeah, you did. Yep, yep. And I love what I do. Yeah, you don't you'll... lose cool points for compassion. Exactly. So we'll be around at conventions all year. We got like seven more conventions this year, but yeah, we'll yeah. be all around showing that it's cool to love cats and be crazy cat ladies. So there you go. <laughs> One time we went, uh, we went trapping together and it was... Uh, <clears throat> There was like so many cats at this one little house and there was one cat, uh, um, there was a tiny little orange kitten that was hiding under a car. And I spent probably an hour and a half trying to grab this little kitty until we finally got a kitten trap and got it to climb in there. But it was one of my first times trapping. And so all the, everyone else was like, man, like it's, it's okay if we can't get it. I was like, no, we're getting he was this cat. Committed. Oh yeah. Like he was, Nathan was over there forever. I had to go find him like a couple times. He was going to get this cat. Yep. Yep. So we got it. Name is Tang. Uh, Tang got a forever home. But yeah, there's, man, after doing that, I'm like, oh, there's kittens out here that need saving. Oh, yeah. man, I'm in. I'm yeah. invested. Yeah. So it's always crazy. And I've got on top of that RV and rap cat songs and all oh, types yeah. of stuff. So it's all the reaction. I think. It attracts people, but at first they don't know if I'm the ice cream truck or if I'm rescuing cats, but it does attract people. And it's, it's just a little good to have a visual like that, like an inviting visual when you're doing something like, like that. Like a bathrobe, so, hypothetically right. speaking, you know? <laughs> Beagle Freedom, oh, they're an amazing organization. So they, they just rescue animals from testing labs. They have pigs, they have bunnies, uh, but yeah, they've been pulling beagles from all over the country. Um, cats i partnered up with them because they they have um they have a huge following but it's all dog people so when they go to rescue cats they're like okay show us more beagles so they reached out to me a while back i'm like hey can you help us promote these seven kittens that we just rescued and i promoted them luckily my followers are amazingly supportive we got them all adopted or fostered and then they told me about this big thing where they were buying a testing lab and i was like oh i'm in and i reached out to a bunch of my sponsors and we ended up raising roughly $150,000 worth of supplies in two weeks. And we shipped it out there. I went out, filmed with it. And then we decided we were building a cat cafe, which is gonna be Nathan's Cat Lady Lounge. Super excited. And, uh, but they needed someone to build. And I used to be a handyman carpenter. So I started ripping down walls and building the framing. And it was a long week, but uh, yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun. I'm going back out there in April and hopefully bringing more brands and more people and just rescuing animals.